Stealing. Those children were hungry, and they that's had uh, called stealing. And if oh. they catch you, you'll spend the next three weeks in the stocks. The stocks. How's it going there, Omar? Oh, huh. I have been better. Thanks for asking, Aladdin. Could do with something to eat, though. This way. Um, how much trouble are we in? You're only in trouble if you get caught. Stop! Please, with Aladdin! That's you. Me? I'll see you on the other side. Now? Oh. Gotta keep. I ask the sands of time to reveal your secrets to me. To show me the one who can retrieve the lamp. Light of hand. Alchemist Strix, I need real power! I need the lamp! See, cow, diamond in the rough. Where? Where will I find him? Tell me. <laughs> the cat was right. <laughs> he likes you. I know. Because in Scotland, cats love me. Hey, puss, puss. Hey, puss, puss. Hey, puss, puss. Raja? Prince Anders. Yeah? We have been told you brought us a special gift from your homeland. Can you guess what it is? Oh, um... Dolly is good at this game. What could it be? Yes, what could it be? What do you get? Is it a giraffe? No, it's not... No. Is it a male cow? Oh, you're so close! Is it a female cow? You're so close! Is it a gaggle of geese? No gaggles of geese. So it's not a gaggle? <laughs> You naughty girls, you lied. You're not good at this game. <laughs> Surprise! It's a cannon. It's a cannon. In Scotland, everything we make is sleek and minimal. Oh, it's very impressive. Yeah. But we are a humble people, Prince Anders. Not impressed with the gift so much as the sentiment behind it. Sentiment? It's for the... Your desire for war? No! It's just a very big gun! Our princess fails to understand that no man desires war. But a ruler must prepare for it nonetheless. Yeah, <laughs> whatever that means. The princess also wonders if in preparing for this war, you induce the very conflict you seek to avoid. No, no, my dear. Ah. The princess has read something about statecraft. The princess is delighted to receive your gift, Prince Anders. As are we. Please. Yes, yes. We, we will target that boat over there with, uh, with the crosshairs. Drum roll, please. Yes. Okay, prepare yourselves. It's very loud. Good night. Impressive, Prince Anders. Yeah, it's a very, very good design. Tell me, Prince Anders, which boat were you trying to hit? That one over there. So not the one with the target on it. Isn't the one sinking... 
I could just make you a prince. Oh, no. Right, you'd be snuggled up with that dude for the rest of your life. Yo, see my palace? Okay? I had a guy one time called Zaid the Snake, wished to be irresistible to all women. Yeah, that was good for about 90 seconds. While lead the wicked wished, I want to hold the power of the universe in my hands. <laughs> Sticky Thief Sharif wished that anything I touch will turn to gold. <laughs> so I gave it to him. <laughs> Moral of the story, be clear, be specific with your words. The deal is in the detail. Baba, I've been thinking. Maybe this year we could celebrate the Harvest Festival outside of the palace walls, like we used to. That's a nice thought, Jasmine, but the city is too dangerous now. If only you'd go into the city, Jasmine. you'd see what Jafar is doing to Akaba. Myself! Jafar, I've been looking for you. I was delayed in the city on an urgent matter. It was a riot in the marketplace. More guards were needed. More guards, Papa? Yes, more guards. You wouldn't understand the dangers of the city, Princess. Venturing out rarely as you do. But come to think of it, I did hear about your recent trip. What? Akim spotted her out, alone, in a marketplace. I told you you are not to leave this palace. That is exactly what he wants. For us to be prisoners while he rules in our place. That's enough, Jasmine. I have no idea what is happening out there. Hakim, tell him. Tell the Sultan what Agraba has become. That it isn't the city we grew up in. The people were threatened by your soldiers, not by criminals. I encouraged your interests in these affairs so long as they didn't threaten your safety. No more. Your mother might be here today if I had... I will post more guards outside the princess's chambers at once. Thank you, Jafar. Mother would not have wanted it this way. All I've been trying to do is just to protect her. Maybe she's right. Jasmine is an intelligent woman. Perhaps we should include her in our council no, meetings. No, my sultan, your first instincts were right. You must protect her. <sighs> Until we find her, this elusive prince. <laughs> but in the absence of such an event, we should think about an alternative successor to your throne, your majesty. Someone like you, Jim. Me? Has to be you, Jafar. Me? It must be you, Jafar. Of course, like me, you silly old fool. Give it to me now, now. Jafar. I'm sure our suitable prince will appear. No, no, th thank you so much. He, he doesn't deserve it. He's been a really naughty boy. Thank you so much. <clears throat> Say something. So, what do you intend to buy with this expensive? You, girl! Now, that was a misunderstanding. So, are you suggesting that I am for sale? Of course. I comes here to buy me a lady. I don't think I sound like that. No, that's me being kind. You made me look bad. I am a good genie. Give me that. Pass me a nut. Had I known you were that bad with women, I would have changed our entire strategy to something where you didn't talk. I'm not gonna lie to you. This is a tragedy. You said you had a connection. We did. I, I do. No. No more talking. 
You've said quite enough for today, Mr. Genie Master. You've got one more chance tonight at this party. But I need you to go sit in that corner and marinate on what you've done and prepare yourself for round two. And I'm gonna lay here, just rest my eyes and try to shake off this afternoon. Ooh, fireworks. I like fireworks. Only thing I love more than fireworks is a party. Time's up. Let's go.